Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon. In this video, I'll be showing my Pokemon XY Black Star promo card collection. If you're interested in seeing any other XY series collection videos, you'll want to check out my collection playlist link in the description of this video. So, in total, there are 210 different Black Star promo cards that you can get for the XY series of sets. And the way you get these Black Star promo cards is through blister packs, tins, collection boxes, league events and pre-releases, and the Pokemon World Championships. And in total in my collection, I have 195 XY Black Star promo cards. And unfortunately, not all of the Black Star promo cards in my collection made this video. I didn't start organizing my cards until recently, so some of the earlier XY Black Star promo cards you will not see in this video. Did a lot of searching and didn't have enough time to find all of the cards I needed. So first up I will show the Spirit Link Trainer cards. I just have two Black Star promo cards of Spirit Link Trainers and really anytime you get an EX Premium Collection box that includes a Mega EX you're going to have the corresponding Spirit Link card with that. So the two Spirit Link Black Star promo cards I have are Camerupt and then Sharpedo. And then all you have to do is look at the bottom right hand corner. You can see the large black star with the word promo across it. And that's how you know it is a black star promo. And for the most part, promo cards aren't worth that much. They range in value to really about 50 cents up to $30. Salamence EX, which I'll show later in this video, is worth around $30. And then if you have any of the staff pre release cards or a finalists, semi-finalists, etc. of the World Championships Black Star promo cards. Those can be worth up to $90. So next up I'll show the Black Star promo holo cards that I have in my collection. I have 20 total and I have one each except for the Magikarp. So I'll go through these. Here's Rayquaza. I'm going oldest to newest at least XY number wise. This one is XY64. And all these cards are up for trade especially the ones I have duplicates of. But in trade I'm really only looking for gold star cards. Of course gold star cards are very valuable so I'd be able to trade multiples of those cards for one gold star. And here's an example of a pre-release card, the only one I have in my collection. You'll see it has the set name in the bottom right hand corner of the illustration window and it is a Black Star promo, Moltres. I have three of this Magikarp, one out of the plastic and then two in the plastic. I believe it was for the Pokemon event day at Target. It is similar to the Shining Magikarp from the Neo Revelation set, similar to that in style at least. And then here is Zygarde, Ho-Oh, -Oh. now a couple of my favorite holo cards of Black Star promos, Ho-Oh -Oh and Lugia, and I will be doing a top 10 XY Black Star promo Pokemon card list this Friday. Here's a Giratina, Celebi, Shaman, and some of these are from the Pokemon Mythical Collection boxes, Victini, Manaphy, Keldeo, Mew, there's a Meloetta, Darkrai, do like the looks of this one quite well, Jirachi, Genesect, and then an Arceus. So there are all of the Hollow Black Star promo cards I have. And again, I do have a lot more in my collection. No idea where they're at right now, so I was not able to include them in this video. So next up are the Pokemon Break Black Star promo cards. I have 13 in my collection. First up here would be Empoleon, and I have two Empoleon. There's a Behem, Noctowl. I have two Ho-Oh, and like I mentioned earlier, do like Ho-Oh quite well. I was a big Generation 2 fan, especially since I played a over a thousand hours in Pokemon Crystal. So the second generation of Pokemon really meant a lot to me. Then there's a Wobbuffet. I believe it was available in the Break Evolution box with Lugia and Ho-Oh. Then I have two Arcanine. Crobat I also have two of. And Mandibuzz I have two of as well. And at the end of this video, I will lay out all these Black Star promo cards out on the table just to give a good overview of them. 
Next up, I'll be showing the full art Black Star promo cards I have, and these are mainly from the different legendary collection boxes, both Pikachu and Hoopa. I have several of each. I actually bought a lot of the Pikachu one just because that was a valuable EX card at the time. So, 28 total. I have just one of this Reshiram. I have four Palkia, and I really do like the artwork on these cards. Just a very glossy finish to the cards, not a texture or anything like some full art cards have. Very shiny. Then there is a Zekrom. Do like that Palkia is in the background there. I have four Zekrom as well. And these cards are worth about a couple of dollars a piece. And there is a Latius. I have four Latius. Do like a couple of other Pokemon in the background there. And then Black Kyurem I also have four of. White Kyurem, just the one. Regigigas I have two of. One Manaphy. Victini I have two of. Genesect, I also have two of. Do like the looks of this card quite well. And then there is a Meloetta, a Volcanion, and then a Magirna. And I really don't have a goal of trying to collect all the Black Star promo cards. A goal of mine is to open up all the new products released. So, other than some of the pre release cards and the World Championships promos, I really do have most of the Black Star promos. Next up would be the Black Star promo EX cards, and I have 96 total. I always made sure to set these aside. So, I definitely knew where all of these were. I can go through all of them. I have duplicates of quite a few of them. And then I have EX full art cards and Mega EX cards to show as well. So, I'll break this up here. Starting off with Xerneas. And a lot of these are from tins, and then there are special EX boxes that some of these are from as well. I have two Eveltal. And again, I'm going oldest to newest XY promo wise. One Charizard. There is one Chestnut, Delphox, Greninja I have two of, and for the most part I prefer water type starters over any other type. Crocodile I also have two of, then I have four Venusaur, and grass type Pokemon for me are usually the least favorite of the three, water, fire, and then grass. Another Charizard I have one of. Blastoise, I have five of. And I have, or in the process of opening all 25 XY series EX tins, so definitely take a look at that playlist if you have not already. And then one Metagross, this is a shiny Metagross EX. And then Kyogre, I have three of. There's one there, and then I'll get to the other two. So here are the other two right on top. Then I have four Groudon. I prefer Kyogre over Groudon. Found that out in my top 10 Mega EX full art list. Deancey is next. Glade. Sceptile, I have three of. Blaziken, I have four of. And then Swampert, I have six of. So, a ton of Swampert. Like I said, I opened up a lot of tins on my channel, so I have a lot of these duplicates of EX cards. And then Flygon is next. Absol. And then I have two Shiny Rayquaza. I believe this was from the Shiny Rayquaza collection box. Tyrantrum, just one of. Hoopa, I have three of. And Latios, I also have three of. And then this Rayquaza, I have two of, one here and then one on the other stack there. Just don't want to take all of these cards at once and risk dropping them right on the table. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this out of here, just so it doesn't get in the way. So here is the second Rayquaza. There's Pikachu. 
A lot of people are fans of Pikachu EX. Aerodactyl, I have three of. Aurorus. Mawile, I have four of. Shiny Gyarados, I have two of. This Mewtwo, I have three of. Mewtwo EX is in a couple of different tins, I believe. Machamp EX, I also have three of. And then I have two of this Shaman EX. One here, and then I have one in the plastic wrap that I can show here in a second. Keep it in the plastic wrap here. It really doesn't make that much of a difference if it's in the plastic wrap or not. Next up would be Shiny Xerneas. Just one of this card. And then I have three Shiny Eveltal. I think I prefer the Eveltal to the Xerneas, at least in shiny form. Zygarde I have three of, and this is one of the more valuable tins to buy just because Zygarde is a little bit better in the TCG. Beedrill, I just have one of these, a fairly new EX Premium Collection box. Garchomp is next. And then I have two Salamence, and like I mentioned in the open of this video, this card is very valuable. It's worth about $30 just because it is good in the TCG. Volcanion, dual type, three of these. This Pikachu, I have three of. Magearna, I also have three of. And then Mewtwo, I have two of. EX Full Art cards are next, and in total, I have 13 of these, and most of them are from the red and blue collection boxes, and these EX Full Art cards are glossy. They do not have that texture to them. But first up here would be Charizard. I have four of these. Actually, not a huge fan of this Charizard card. In my opinion, there sometimes are too many Charizard Ultra Rares. Do know there's a Charizard GX coming in the set that's going to be released in August after Guardians Rising. So next up is Blastoise. I have five of these. Then I have two Venusaur. And then one Pikachu, which I think I like the Pikachu best of those previous ones that I've shown. And then I have one Mew EX Full Art. This card is fairly valuable. It's worth around $15. And this is from the Mew and Mewtwo Super Premium Collection Box. Do not have or at least couldn't find my Mewtwo EX Full Art. Now that I think about it, I might have even kept it in the original box. But two EX Full Art cards you can get there. I believe this is the reprinted one from Dragon's Exalted, so that's why it has some value. Final type of Black Star promo card that I'll be showing would be the Mega EX, and in total I have 23 of these. Starting off with this Mega Metagross EX, and I have given away a bunch of these Mega EX Black Star promo cards as well. Then there's Deancey, I have two of. Absol, I also have two of. Same goes for Blaziken. Swampert, same thing. Aerodactyl, I have three of. I've always been a fan of Aerodactyl ever since the Fossil set. When I opened up my first edition Fossil Booster box, pulled a ton of Aerodactyl out of there. Mawile, I have four of. Then Beedrill, I just have the one of, like I mentioned earlier, a somewhat new EX Premium Collection box. One of my favorite Mega EX cards would be this shiny Mega Gengar EX. I believe it's from one of the collector's chests. Garchomp, I have two of. Mega Salamence, I just have the one of. And then one each of Mega Camerupt and then Mega Sharpedo. So there are all the Mega EX cards. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this video and then I'll be right back with all the cards laid out on the table. Okay, so I'm back and here are all 195 XY Black Star promo cards laid out on the table. Very fun to collect all these cards. Cannot wait 
to collect the, all the Sun and Moon Black Star promo cards when they are released. And like I mentioned, I'll do several more collection videos in the very near future on my channel. Definitely make sure to check those out. We'll zoom in a little bit just on the individual cards. I have the break cards on the left-hand side. Those full art cards on the top. Mega EX and EX in the middle and on the side there are a lot of EX cards. And then towards the bottom are some of the EX cards and EX full art cards. Break over there. Hollows way over to the left. So there you have it. Thanks everyone for watching. As always, before you go, check out all the links in the description of this video, including links to my blog, Facebook, and Twitter pages. And stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.